Hey guys, my name is Ankush Gaurav and I welcome you to Gone to Series. In the earlier tutorials, we installed JDK, set the path environment variable and created a hello world program using a notepad. Now we're going to download and install Eclipse IDE. Eclipse is an excellent editor which programmers use to write Java programs. You may use any other text editor like Notepad or any other text editor of your choice. But generally, programmers prefer it over other editors because it has a lot of advanced features in it like automatic wizards which we can learn while writing Java programs using Eclipse ID in my subsequent tutorials. Alright, so let's download and install Eclipse ID. Go to Eclipse website and from this drop down choose operating system you have. I have Windows so I'm choosing it. Here you're going to download Eclipse ID for Java developers, this one. Here choose 64-bit or 32-bit depending upon your operating system type. Since I work on 64-bit operating system, I'm going to choose Eclipse ID for Windows 64-bit. Now click here and it will get you to a page where you can download Eclipse ID for your computer. Now click here and this will start downloading. Once it is completed, click on it and unzip all its contents in your local drive. So I'm doing it on my D drive. So with this step, I've unzipped all Eclipse contents in my local D drive under Eclipse folder. Let's check in the directory Eclipse what I have unzipped there. So go to the Eclipse directory where I've unzipped all the contents. And then you will find here one shortcut with the name Eclipse. Double click on it and it will open Eclipse ID. Here before opening Eclipse, it is asking where we want to save the programs or applications which we are going to write using Eclipse ID. So you may provide any path here where you would want to save your Java application or programs. So click on OK. So this is the Eclipse ID which we have just installed on our computer for writing Java programs. In our subsequent tutorials, we are going to learn how to write Java programs using Eclipse ID. Guys, please like this video if it really helped you and don't forget to subscribe to my channel Conto Series and I'm going to catch you in my next tutorial.